because the World Bank has dispensed $12 billion to several African countries, including uh, DR Congo, to postage COVID-19 vaccines. Like many other countries, DRC is relying on COVAX, a global initiative that seeks to achieve an equal distribution of vaccines. Developed countries have already bought more than half of the COVID-19 dollar vaccines. Here are more details of that in this report. The World Bank Group president announced the availability of $12 billion for African countries to purchase COVID-19 vaccines at a virtual meeting. The funds will be given as grants or low-cost loans to Ghana, Ethiopia, Niger, Mozambique, Cape Verde, Iswatini, Tunisia and the Democratic Republic of Congo. The bank has urged other African countries that have not yet requested for its support to do so. The DRC, like many African countries, is depending on COVAX, a global initiative that seeks to ensure equitable access to the vaccines. I think the country expressed his interest to be part of the COVAX uh, that is supported by WHO and to make sure that the country uh, will also get the vaccine uh, and uh, make sure that we can, using this vaccine, um, vaccinate uh, around 20% of the population. But this is still in a process and we don't know exactly when uh, the vaccine can get in country. Um, I heard uh, that uh, probably around April, May or June, but we don't know exactly when, exactly when we will get the vaccine and we still don't know which vaccine we will choose. The bank's support to African countries comes as wealthy nations have already purchased more than half of the doses of leading COVID-19 vaccines. The World Health Organization has urged rich countries to stop hoarding vaccine supplies and start supporting poorer countries to access them. According to the Africa Centers for Disease Control, the cost of vaccinating 60% of Africa's 1.3 billion people would be between 10 and 15 billion dollars. The World Bank dispensed $12 billion to several African countries to buy COVID-19 vaccines.